Uh, in this video, we will render and display the spreadsheet on our web page in React.js uh, using uh, this library. Okay, first of all, we will install the library npm install react excel render renderer. Okay, first of all, we will install this one. I have already installed it. Let's see it. React excel. See it? React excel renderer so after installing this library we will import it import out table out table and excel and error from react Excel render we never imported this so first of all I will create an input field type should be file and also on change whenever we select an excel file then we should call handle file we should call this method to get the file let's create this one const handle file is equal to our own function will uh, come with an uh, event so here we will get the file uh, so i will store the file just directly i will get the file const file is equal to event dot target dot files is zero okay after getting the file, so now we will use this excel renderer method. So our file and we should have error and response. So here first of all if there was an error so what it will do it will uh, print us console.log the error print the error to else 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 so now i will declare two variables the two state for columns for values and for the header one for the header so let's create them const header set header is equal to i will use use state hook and it is in array type with us so let's sign array to this and also second one would be columns columns with us and set calls okay is equal to use state now let's assign values to that first of all set header Header, I will assign response dot rows response dot calls dot dot row sorry and the zero index okay the zero row I should fix the zero rows from uh, that okay and the second to put the columns are the values set header set sorry calls response dot rows it will fetch all the rows so now let's display display our data so to display the data first i will declare a table after declaring the first would be t header and here I should have a table row in the table row I should use the header okay to map the data from header I should use this header that map and here should be header and index let's declare th and assign a key to it that would be high and print the 
uh, header here okay the name of the that okay so let that let just add some design to this class name um, uh, style sorry style is equal to border collapse is equal to collapse and also not is equal to it should be column and also let's add margin that would be 10 pixel and go to and the same this should be for copy just remove this you model to watch into that okay and let's uh, now add the same now i will fix the t body body and here i will map the data calls dot map and here we will use so by default this columns okay this has uh, the value of uh, i will just change it to rows okay leave it so this has the all values including the header okay you see that here i pitch just the header from this rows okay so now i will just uh, remove the header from this data okay to remove the header i will just use the slice function slice and i will remove the first one the first element and here just write call and index and here i will use the table row i will assign key to this table row key should be i index and now i will use again the map function for it it here i just pitch the this is just the first row or second or third row with me okay so now i will pitch the data of this row to pitch the data of rows i will just try it like call dot map sorry dot map and here i will write c and index here i will print the table data I will assign key to this that would be I and I will print the data that would be C with us. So just I will add the border collapse the border. Here I will add one another CSS class border one pixel so that black. Just I will copy this for all the also for the th. Here I will add this okay and same to for table data. See it okay? We have this. So now let's try it. Come here. So we have this. Let's play click on this. Let's click on this. See it. We have that. Let's just check this. Uh, uh, margin 10 pixels and auto just put it in yeah it's okay okay leave it right now so it was fetching data from an excel file so you can design that just it is an excel file with us see it we have this data here so you have um, this uh, concept you it was all about fetching data from an excel file um, i i left the out table okay you can use the out table but uh, there you don't have the customization here what that would print that will print all the the same uh, and also it will print the column of the excel a b c okay it will print those also but uh, reading and printing like this it will be customized form of that so thanks for watching